from Denver 7. This is 7 News. Just ahead on 7 News Saturday morning, our visit from Associated Landscape Contractors of Colorado. And this morning, some ideas to turn your home into a spring show place this year. In the meantime, with snow still on the ground, more snow in the forecast, it is hard to believe that February is the perfect time to start thinking about your spring landscape and garden plants. And joining us now with some ideas for your yard is Carol Kassler from Associated Landscape Contractors of Colorado. Good morning to you. Good morning. Thanks for braving the snow to yeah. make it on down here. And well, I, I know this is a topic that a lot of people care about because it's fun to start thinking about spring is. and uh, how you might be able to make your yard look beautiful. What are some good ideas? Well, we're looking at trends this year about renovations, fixing up tired and old landscapes, um, water features, adding those with xeric elements because we're still very conscious of water use mm -hmm. and conservation. We have a streetscape photograph we'll be looking at that shows a great way to treat that area between the sidewalk and the street. And then container gardening, um, both raised gardening for kitchens, kitchen gardening, and then as, as well raised um, containers. Yeah. So yeah, this is the uh, kitchen garden okay. idea and doing raised gardens. It eliminates weed problems. Oh, that is nice. You don't have to bend over. As far as that piece goes with the weed problems, is it still just filling it up with dirt in those containers? Yes. Okay. Good dirt. Good dirt. But, but you're it not gives starting rooting. with the grass. Exactly. <laughs> Maybe. And this is a renovation. Um, obviously, you can see tired, old landscape. And one of the things I wanted to point out in this is you don't even notice the beautiful front door on this property right. as you come up. So for a guest, that's not very inviting. Um, and then. This is the after, and you wow. can see how it really starts to focus on the front door, which is what you want. Container. Um, a lot more color in that one, too, yes, which yeah. is very inviting. Yes, and it's seasonal. You can get mm -hmm. this uh, a good look in the winter as well with structure like this. Okay, and, and we have some more pictures that we're going through. Uh, talk a little bit about this one, again, using vegetation to add some variety. Right. Th these are c container gardens, which are really okay. big now, and you can add color anywhere in the yard and instantly. You can bring it in in the middle of the summer and change it out. And you can incorporate tropicals um, using them such as annuals, uh, which really expands the plant palette and what we can do here for color, which is nice for Colorado. So beyond thinking about what you might want to do and kind of where you're heading when springtime rolls around, what types of things should we be preparing for now so that uh, when the time comes to be able to plant stuff, we'll be ready? That's a great question. Um, it's really tough this time of year to envision what areas of the yard you want to work mm -hmm. on and what needs to be worked with um, because of all the snow. But it's really important for people to focus on how their yard looks from a front entry approach because that's first impression. Um, and also to fix up their patio and entertainment areas and that's where water features can come in um, really nicely. But planning ahead calling an expert at ALCC.com, okay. uh, contacting through the website, is a great way to get started. That sounds like a good plan. And of course, you also mentioned that you can, you know, plant seasonal and uh, plants that give you some some kind of a look year round. So you exactly. can look at what you have in the winter and say, oh, I don't really have much of anything. Maybe that helps you think too, what plants you might want to want to get and purchase for the year ahead. Exactly. That's, right. You said it well. <laughs> well. Carol Kessler, thank you so much for coming in Thanks. this morning. Appreciate your ideas and the pictures that you thank shared you. with us. As always, you can log on to our website at thedenverchannel.com. Click on that big red TV button and we have a link provided there for more information.